Wait, are we live? Oh, okay. Yeah. Oh, I was listening to some Indian music, and I really like music. It's one of my hobbies in the long term. Those music is such beautiful that I want to research more about why the music sounds the way it does, especially the rhythm. So I went online and tried researching about why the percussion instruments make the noise they do, and I found a very weird connection between a physicist and these Indian percussion instruments. Uh, we know the physicist is famous for the Raman effect. Yes, you guessed it right, C. V. Raman. He has done a lot of research in Indian music while also pursuing his passion in physics. Let's dig deep and find out more. This is C. V. Raman, the physicist who I was talking about. So, who was C. V. Raman? Well, he was a renowned physicist and scientist from India. He was born on 7th November 1888. He was born in Trichinopoly, which is Madras Presidency, which is current Tamil Nadu in British India. He died on 21st November 1970 in Bangalore. Uh, that picture shows Trichinopoly in 1907. Raman got his first job in the Indian Financial Civil Services while also conducting great research for the Indian Association for the Cultivation of Sciences or IACS for short. Here, he was introduced to amazing research, articles and material about music and science. He wanted to connect those two together and the term he used for it is called Jugal Bandi. Raman didn't know where to start, so he took inspiration from a Victorian scientist called Lord Rayleigh. He is famous for the discovery of the element argon in 1905. But what interested Raman was the sound was that he discovered how the sound of a bell is propagated through the air. In 1919, he began researching on the acoustics of a mudunga, where he got started on his musical research. But he didn't leave science behind. He researched on the, dis on the dispersion of light through a prism and devised the Raman effect, for which he got the Nobel Prize in 1930. But then we were back to music. In 1935, an, a musical article written by Raman was published in the Proceedings of the Indian Academy of Sciences. Raman's musical research was focused on percussion instruments such as tabla and mudunga. The other research which he conducted was primarily on the ektara, but also violin, flute, and veena. Interesting fact coming in. Uh, there was only uh, one European instrument which he found musical, which was the violin. Raman always said that ask the right questions and nature will open the doors to her secrets. Raman took inspiration from Lord Rayleigh. Indian Academy of the Cultivation of Sciences and he was fascinated by the Mrudunga. His successes were massive. Nobel Prize for the Raman Effect, article in the India's most renowned scientific journal uh, and Tabla and Mrudunga research. Because of him, we know the sound of music today. His research was the first scientific one to be conducted on Indian percussion instruments. His research has played a major role in the development of the field of optics and quantum mechanics based on sound. Thanks for watching. Please don't forget to like, share and subscribe. Also, tell me what topic you guys would like me to explain about in the next video. Stay home and stay safe. Bye.